What's up, YouTube? This your boy, King Cole, bring you a quick update. Got the LEDs put on the truck. Um, I'm planning on going ahead and getting a Calais Escalade body from this guy. It's pretty much the same size as the Magnum body. Uh, gonna go ahead and extend the 4x4 four, uh, four four slash. Then make it a 1 5th scale, 1 6th scale. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put those type, hold on, I'm sorry, I'm cut the lights back up. I'm gonna put those type tires on for the time being until I can give me some 9.9s. Uh, um, and pretty much that's gonna be my little, you know, trail truck until I can get an actual rock crawler. Now, I was looking at a form and the guy took a, what, you, what is that thing called? A RPM. Um, a arms and put some tie rod ends or tie tie rod, the little rod, the middle rod or whatever that connects your I forgot what you call this damn thing. This piece right here. He added a few of them on he had two of those on the A arm to be able to extend it out and that's probably even that part there up because it's like that on the same side as well. Um, I got a set of these tires coming in in the mail. These are from Duratrax, um, Duratrax Warhammer. I'm going to go ahead and, and wrap them with some, you know, low, well, with some one-tenth scale tires. Um, and it should do just fine for what I'm trying to, you know, accomplish with this. Um, let's show you the back lights on this. But pretty much, uh, I might just go back down to brush system because, I mean, the light bulb right now that's in there, it's sitting in there, I can't charge it um, because pretty much it's expand. And everybody knows you can't charge an expand battery because it have a ten, um, have a chance of catching fire. And I don't feel like losing anything in this house nor having to replace the carpet in here even though it's going to have to be replaced anyway but um, also I want to take the flashers out of this because I can't like once I get the actual Fly Sky GT3C in I'm not going to be able to switch the settings on it I mean I can switch it now but well right now I can't because it's like Matter of fact, hold on, I'm gonna take the body off. Alright, I'm back. But yeah, as you can see, this is one of those little buttons that you pretty much you press it and you know you cut them off, press it again, it does the flash. But the problem is it is it don't stay in. So even if I did be able to get this removed, I don't know how to solder or wire it up to where I can be able to do this off that third channel on that fly sky so I mean if anybody has any you know ideas of how I can do that please let me know other than that I might have to just replace the light system in here to get it that way yes that's the that's the chassis yes it looks horrible but um pretty much um that's pretty much all I can think of the update about. Um, <sighs> it's been a tough struggle. Also, I want to go ahead and put some something in there to make the lights shine a little bit brighter and better. I mean, it looks good as it is now, but you know, I want to be able to make it shine like the front of this is. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Now you can see it for yourself. It's brighter than normal. And I mean, even down here with these, they're not shining as bright, but it does the job. But that's pretty much what I'm planning on doing. Um, they look like they're shining bright now, but that's pretty much because I'm sitting down. When you adjust it, it's not that bright. 
well people that's pretty much all I can think of to say about that um, if anybody got any ideas or would like to leave a comment ask any questions you know just comment and hit the like button for me you know I really appreciate it and thanks for your time looking at my video take it easy